Hi, I hope we're okay and having a good week. I've been spending some time reading John and I just wanted to encourage you guys with some thoughts that I've had whilst reading it that I feel like God has encouraged me with so hopefully it will encourage you too. I've particularly been looking at the story of Jesus feeding the 5,000 and kind of what that means um, now and I felt God was encouraging me with that story and um, when Jesus had the crowds of people and he was with his disciples they'd followed him there after he'd been doing miracles and healing people so there was a huge crowd of people and they obviously were hungry and God asked Philip what should they eat how could they feed them where could they get bread from to feed these people and Philip understandably looked at the crowd of people and couldn't get his head around how they could feed them they didn't have enough money to buy enough bread to feed them and he thought about how he was lacking what they were lacking and um, rather than who he was with and it just kind of really made me think about how we probably do similar things in our own lives all the time how we can sometimes hear that whisper of God's voice or feel that nudge or get that feeling within ourselves that God is asking something from us like he asked Philip how are we going to feed these people we sometimes can feel like God is asking something from us but instead of thinking about who it is who's asked us to do it and having that assurance in Jesus we think about how we are lacking what we're lacking in we think about how we're not ready for it how we don't have the right tools or gifts or resources to do what he's asking us to do and we kind of worry about it or we sit on it and we don't act on it and we don't do what he's asked us to do and it says in the version in John, which you can read in John 6, 1 to 15, that God was kind of testing Philip because he already knew, you know, he's Jesus. He already knew what um, what they were going to do, what the solution was. And I think it can be similar in our own situations. Um, sometimes when we show that obedience and we do what God has asked us to do, even if we're not equipped for it, even if we're not ready, he will show up when we need what we feel like we're lacking. We, um, instead of talking ourselves out of it, we can have confidence in God and that confidence in who it is who's asked us to do the thing rather than worry about what we're lacking and what we don't have. So it was just to encourage you really that if you feel like God has asked something of you, if you feel like he's asked you to do something or you feel that nudge that you should take a step forward for him in something he's asked you to do, but you're worried that you're lacking in an area or you feel like you're not equipped to do it, to have that that confidence, that godly boldness to take that step because um, when you need God and when you need the resources he will show up and he will equip you so if God's asked you to do it he will equip you for what he's asked you to do have confidence in who he is and who is asking you to do it don't worry about what you feel you haven't got in order to get the job done I hope that encourages you and keep taking steps forward keep trusting him and he will equip you and get you ready for the work that he's got planned out for you Have a good week. Bye.